Aloha, this is Sky, the Soulful Progressive with FNN Feminist News Network, the feminist news that's right for you. Welcome to Sky on Location. That's right, giving you that soulful news you need. Yes, indeed. And if you haven't told a friend to like and subscribe to FNN, you better let them know that soulful news is in, friend. I know that's right. Get it well. The getting's good. I know. Mm -hmm. So what do I want to talk about today? What is really going on? Bernie Sanders. I know that's right. He's priming and getting ready for it. The July 30th debate. And how is he getting ready? How is he showing that his poll numbers are strong for a reason? Because he's got a plan for the season. I know that's right. He has gotten together with uh, other candidates and Omar to present a new plan out there. All right. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. All right, so what has Bernie proposed? He has proposed a new bill that's being co-signed by anyone that can jump aboard. Why? Because it's income, equality, and basic health and services for seniors and disabled. Damn right and about damn time. He wants to shore up and pick up and put more into Social Security. Now, this is a plan only if he becomes president. Now, this is a plan that's already being talked about by Yang with his basic income. It's already being mentioned by Telsey with her living affordability plan. Kamala Harris has a similar plan, but who in the Frick is listening to her. We know that her plan will get snatched back the second that she gets paid by a corporate entity. Uh huh. She's two facing her whole way through the uh, presidential uh, run. Mm hmm. And we know that to be true. And if I'm not lying, I know that I am telling the truth. I, I I'm not. You know, I'm not lying. She she she's. You know what? Cut that part out. <clears throat> because we know that she isn't right for this job. Mm -hmm. She just two-faced and all over it. Mm -hmm. the, the whole presidential run, that is. Now, this is perfect for Bernie. This is what the people need. Because even though the core group of voters are African-American females, the other core group of voters are your seniors. Hello? Those are the ones that get up at 530 in the morning to make sure that they are at the polling by 6 a.m. My grandmama and my grandpapa always were the first two at the polling station every year. It was right down the corner from where we lived at the Y, but they were the first ones. That's how old people do. I'm getting older. I find myself showing up at the polls earlier and earlier. That's how I became president of my district. Democratic president of District 26, Precinct 1, Honolulu, Hawaii, your biggest urban district. Yeah. Don't hate. You know you got ADOS in the place. Uh-huh. Now, with that said, we got to understand that in every piece of America, including places like Hawaii, where you have to have an average income of $50 per hour earned to even afford a two-bedroom apartment. Now, this is going to be a game changer to actually care for the elderly, to actually put together now, I'm throwing this in because this is what's needed in Hawaii. Now, you want to contact me, I already got the uh, business plan and the proposal and everything else ready for an intergenerational melee program where you put together seniors that do music with the younger generation so they can collaborate and learn music and play music and do music together. That can work in any state anywhere. You ready to do it? Contact me. But they need things like this for the seniors. 
We need to increase the mortality rate instead of cutting it off like uh, the last three to four presidents have done. Let's go back to five all, all the way. Say six, go back to Reagan, all right? Now, we have, it, it's been lowering ever since the Republicans and, and, and the Southern strategy has taken over uh, the majority of the Congress and the government. Let's, let's get it right. They're not helping people. They're not healing people. They're not making people live longer. They are killing people. They are shoving people to the side. And they're not taking care of your basic hard work in America because they, because even the whitest of the lowest of national trash think they are better than any working class. And that is wrong. And I know that's what's going on. And Bernie is good for mentioning this, and he'll get plenty of votes because with Bernie, you know he's going to stick with his policies. He doesn't plan around. He ain't playing because he's been saying the same damn thing for years and years and years. He just needs to get in the right position so he can implement them. Right? I know it. And if you have comments, show it and leave them below. And contact me if you want at feministnewsin at gmail.com. Still looking for reporters. Let me know if you want to be one to tell your news your soulful way. All right. Do it today. Now, you can reach me at Twitter, progr uh, soulful progress one or reach out to the Facebook Feminist News Network. I got that rant of the day. That's the name of it on Blogger. Check it out. And then I also have Patreon and on and on. So remember, I'm that one woman team. Yes, indeed. So if you want to donate to make this better, I appreciate it. That's PayPal me slash Feminist News Network. So remember, in this era of hate, you got to participate or you'll just end up with no senior being deserved the right place mm, mm, mm. or getting what they deserve within the right place. Either one. Now, thanks for watching. Thanks for joining. Peace. All right. I know that's right.